been going to the Arts at Ed studio, meeting Tom, but the rest of them, brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. How do you think your music has changed before Arts at X and now? So before Arts at X, my music was very bland. No, I was never able to get my expression out. It was very... I always used to rush my music. There was no... That you would never take a feeling away from the song. It always just felt heartless. It just, it just felt, felt like nothing. But now, ever since I've been to Arts and Dance, being around people who have been in the industry, and been, had, had people there to bring out of me what, what I kept inside all them years by doing it by myself. That's what sympathetic me the most, and being able to change from being someone who would just sit in front of a mic with having no idea what to do, um, and also just being afraid of, I don't know, I was just... You get really nervous when you yeah, started music. I was very nervous, whatever. Ever since I've been to Arts at X, that all just went down the drain. I was just so ready just to put myself out there and make everything. Every, every time I've released, ten times better than the other, and I feel like that's... That's going to be proven in my next album, District Zero, coming out this year. <laughs> what exciting stuff are you guys working on now? Oh, oh. oh. right. Well, uh, I keep coming around his house and I'm like, we're going to make some music. And then we ended up doing it. It's always written dominoes and doing f***ing, but like... <laughs> <laughs> I mean, three songs is a start. We've got three songs. We've got three songs. We've got... Set From Above. That's already out. Keep It Cool. And Gatwick. And Gatwick it's really cool to have that kind of like-minded people, and that's yeah. what you need in like I think this kind of uh, creative to be successful. Like if you don't have people that think like you and do the same shit as you, then like you might as well not do it because like you, you need other people to be successful. So we're working on it, but I think the main goal is really just bringing out each other's sounds, yeah, exactly. and experimenting, just just you know being us really. That's amazing. I think we're on our last question now, okay. but um, what advice would you guys give other young people starting your music? Do whatever you want, just just do it. Don't stop, don't hesitate, just do it. Spend the time watching YouTube videos on how to mix, master, find your sound. Don't rush into it, yeah. find your sound and just and like, do what you want. Don't don't, Sky's the limit. Don't be scared to like suck either. Like, <laughs> yeah. I, I, my music, I don't even think it's that great now, but like, uh, and the, the thing about great music, and um, this is not on like my own behalf, this is looking at artists that I love. If you go back to the old and older game, exactly. it gets worse and worse, and it's like they had to get better over time. You had to allow yourself to be to like get what making a good song is to do it on purpose every time. So just like, yeah, like give yourself song. time. Yeah. Don't, don't expect to be the best artist within your first song, first two no. songs. And a big mistake I made was keep releasing albums over and over again, yeah. rushing things out with no. Yeah, need. don't don't rush it. Don't out. rush it out because like there's no point in releasing something if it isn't like true, if it isn't finished. If it's like half assed and you're just trying to think, oh, then, it's going to be out by this. That's not it. Most of my old albums were recorded in probably four hours. <laughs> wow. They, literally, they were just. I think that's what I think that's what I've been doing. I mean, he dropped last night, so. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, definitely. If you're making music and you're starting it out, um, I, I wouldn't call myself a professional. I don't know if I'm, I think he would. He's got a gig. Both professionals. Remember, uh, <laughs> I think just just do it, man. Just and follow your ideas. And don't let anybody stop you from doing what you want to do. Like, Facts. I've had people like, trying to bring me down. This whole time throughout all of my music, mm. you're taking the piss out of me, whatever. So don't, yeah. don't yeah. let them stop you. Let them carry on. Just show them wrong. Join in on the joke. Like make it a good thing. Twist it into a good <laughs> thing. If they're taking the piss out. Of don't, don't let it affect you. Just yeah. do it. Great advice for me, but like that's really inspiring. We're just about finished, but have you guys got anything? You've already had a little plug, but if you want to shout out anything else, please. Shout out, what's the, what's the label called? I can't say. Tenetic, Tenetic Records. Shout out Tenetic Records. Oh. I was about to say Tom to Lightest Records, but still. Tenetic Records. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Yeah.